Hey everyone, I am Justin from Game Theater, and I figured that it was my turn to share some facts with you that you 100% didn't know. So here it is, 10 facts you 100% didn't know about Star Fox. Fact number one, are you aware? Many fan theories have speculated that the Star Fox team have amputated their legs because it makes flight easier. The truth is, they didn't just stop at their legs. They have actually amputated their entire bodies and have had their heads placed on human bodies, which explains why they look the way they do. Fact number two. Star Fox, released in 1437 on the Atari Flashback, was an incomplete game when it originally came out. The developers had mixed up the unfinished Star Fox cartridges with a 100% complete game that they intended to release, Assassin's Creed Unity. A shipping error by FedEx caused the confusion, and Nintendo just went with it. Fact number three. There's a lot of confusion on what exactly the evil genius Andros is supposed to be. He looks almost apish, but this was originally not going to be the case. During an interview with Shigeru Miyamoto as he was chaining himself to a tree, he stated, We originally envisioned Andros as 1 4th Tyrannosaurus Rex, 1 4th Velociraptor, 1 4th Cuttlefish, 1 4th Tree Frog, and 1 4th the musical genre Mariachi. They weren't able to get this to work and had to change it at the last second in the original game to just a face. Fact number four. To help advertise Star Fox 64, Nintendo created a device known as the Star Fax 64. However, this machine was only able to make copies, prank phone calls, and not actually send faxes. This poor marketing choice single-handedly caused the video game crash of 83 BC. Fact number five. The Arwing is in fact not just a ship, but is a live creature that the Star Fox team have enslaved to do their bidding. This is why Slippy refers to the Arwing as this baby, because he is actually inside one of the baby Arwings. Fact number six. Andros is known as a mad scientist, but did you know that his PhD is in cryptozoology? He also has a minor in physical education, and some speculation points out that he may have gone mad because the demand for these jobs are very slim. Fact number seven. Star Fox Adventures may feel like another game that many people have played. This is because Star Fox Adventures is actually a 3D version of Legend of Zelda linked to the Ocarina Mask Princess Sword between Worlds HD. Fact number eight. In Star Fox Assault, the enemies that the Star Fox team has to do battle with are called the Aperoids. The reason that they are named this is because Shigeru Miyamoto once got in a fight against the Appalachian Mountains, which he considers to be his greatest loss. To vent, he had weak creatures named Aperoids placed in the game as an insult to the mountains. Fact number nine. The newest addition to the Star Fox series is Star Fox Zero, and Shigeru Miyamoto has stated in interviews that he chose this because he likes the kanji for Zero, thinking that it sort of resembles a foxtail. But this is yet another lie. This kanji means tonkatsu, which loosely translates to pork cutlet, which is Miyamoto's favorite food. Fact number 10. Few people know that Justin Bieber is an obsessive fan of the Star Fox franchise, but seeing as how the few people that do know, and that most people who don't know probably don't care, I'm questioning why I'm still reading this fact out loud. And there it was. You think you may have learned something today? What facts did you enjoy the most? Let us know in the comments. Also, if you have some free time, why not check out my Let's Play channel, Game Theater. Recently, Free and I played some Star Fox 64. Also, if you enjoyed this video, then why not check out 10 facts you 100% didn't know about Metal Gear Solid. <laughs> I'm still just imagining him punching a mountain. <laughs> But he's a mountain! <laughs> he's a mountain. <laughs> Can't love. <laughs> Can't feel pain.